hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Mora Lizzy you can also call me Ijele wahala for kulo de ship Imaruzu ha very big trouble in Imaru's shipping groups at the moment you can you can see a lot of tweets flying up and down and uh, a lot of buzz booze in Imaru's shipping group I will bring you guys all the juices juice details of juice from Imaru's shipping camp at the moment so please Hit the subscription button so that you can get notifications whenever I drop a new video. For people that are new, please hit the subscription button as well. So that you can get notification whenever I drop a new video. So, as we all know, a Maro's ship is like ozone ship of lockdown. So, a Maro's ship is the largest, when I say the biggest or the largest shipping fan base that came out from Shine Your Eye. So, lately they have become obsessed with the ship that they are attacking everybody any housemate that they see near either emma or either rose they will hunt you down they want to preserve the ship at all costs in fact many shippers are running mad at the moment as they feel used by emma and rose because they are no they no longer see them together putting video together and all that it's only when they hear that there is a little uh problem they will come together snap and put for them just to preserve the ship and be you know extorting money from their contributions and all that so here is a vn that i'll play for you from the emaros shipping fan base we have uh, one of the shippers vented her anger on the latest happenings concerning emma and rose and their so-called love oh so oh guys i i know all of us are emma rose shippers we love them we watch them on our tv we, we, we love them, we, we became fond of them, we like them. And then there's this issue that I have. When the show started, there was a girl named Princess who was running one of Emma's social media platforms during the show. And that girl, when Emma fell in love with the corrupts, that girl used to send videos of her and Emma in hotel rooms, going to the beach, going to buy girls together for grocery was forever they were always together that girl used to visit emma's place uh the hair lip but now after the show that girl said him and emma were best of friends and then we heard of liquor rose and emeka that guy called Cole. that guy called Cole is liquor rose's bestie Luca Rose even asked for Big Brother for him to make a video so that she may know how she's doing in the house and so on. Collie did a video. A and we saw videos of them vibing before the show. And now after the show, they are still vibing. Black is vibes everywhere. Then we have got Emmanuel and Bestie. You know, that girl and Emmanuel used to send those calls things. It, it, was, it was something else. And then they said they were besties. But now Emmanuel and follow that girl. They no longer together. Emmanuel goes to PH. They are no longer chilling together. If I may ask, I know we are shippers. We like Emmanuel and Liquor Rose for who they are and whatsoever. That guy is a fat boy. That guy is a fat boy. She used, he used that girl, Shem. He used that girl. Another girl, I follow her on, on Instagram. She's hurt. I don't want to lie. In as much as you like what you like, guys, that guy is a fat boy. In as much as what they're doing now with Liquor Rose, that guy may be using Rose for film. Uh, uh, you may remove me from the group, but I, I've got this message for you all. Emmanuel is a fat boy. Can you ask him what was his relationship with that girl? called princess i think they were dating because after the show and what what transpired after the show they i don't see them that i, I don't see that they're friends Emmanuel no, no longer comments on or, or, on that girl's post they no longer follow each other what what what's happening because they're besties what what really happened it does not let's not be blinded by this thing called we love them or so ever fame or so ever now nah. that guy is a fat boy Look at what she's, what she's doing now. It's comfortable shooting pictures with other people. Send her black to Rose. She, she's comfortable shooting videos with Cross or whatsoever that, or whosoever that she is, he is with. But you can't see a video of them together now. It's dry, right? Bruh. Those people that said Emma Rose was right during the show, they never lied. All they say was the truth. 
So this is the voice note of one of the Imaru's shippers venting her anger that Ima and Rose doesn't do video together. Aside that, that Emmanuel has somebody before the house that was managing his Instagram accounts or social media accounts and they were vibing, going to the beach and all that. The shipper also called Emmanuel a fat boy. So this is the voice note that you all listen to like before the show okay during the when the show started there was a lady that always posts her pictures of she and emma their videos together and all that even sometimes they wear matching outfits but after some time she was silenced while the show progressed probably not to spoil things for emma because emma just came in and went straight to liquor rose because he said that he has been crushing on liquor rose dancing crew for quite a long time so she went he went straight to the chorus because also he knows that liquorus has a large social media presence so that will help him if he starts the uh, acting love with rules and voice note that the, the ladies emphasize also that emmanuel is using liquor rules there, also, there was also a rumor that Emmanuel has a copper fiancé in his house in Port Harcourt, that the lady is the one that is taking care of his business and managing it and all that. Though all these are rumors, but there is no smoke without fire. Like I said in one of my videos before, that Emmanuel is a Gemini man. Um, Geminis are men born between May the 20th to June the 21st. These natives are very flirtatious. They have their freedom lovers. They are flirtatious. So moving on from one relationship to another, it doesn't. It, they will do it without the blink of an eye. They don't hold on to relationships like that. They are free spirited. They can move on from one person to another without feeling anything. It's not like they won't hurt, but they will hurt and they will move on like in the twinkle of an eye. They are very flirtatious, they are freedom lovers, they don't want to tie you, tie them down for anything. And they love women with class, money and, uh, you know, societal presence. So, they, they can easily dump anybody, they can easily move on to anything. That is the Gemini, the Aquarius and Libra as well. These three signs are called the air signs. They are free-spirited and can move easily from one relationship to another. So, having these tendencies... I didn't say that Emmanuel must do it. I said that he has the tendency. So having these tendencies, expect anything at any time. You know, why the Zodiac is very good for us to know and understand is knowing what tendencies that you have. That is what it is I am teaching in this channel. Exposing you to know the tendencies that people have. Not necessarily that they will use it at the moment. That's why I always tell you guys that our energies are fluid and is susceptible to change. So having these energies in us, having these things in us, it is susceptible to change. We, due to the power of our free will, we can change anything. If you are keeping malice with someone, you can decide to talk to them. It's your free will. So that is how you change the energies. You can keep in malice with them for two years, three years, until when you decide to speak to them, that is when the energy changes due to the power of your free will. So Gemini, Aquarius, and Libra has the free will and they have this tendency of flirtatiousness and changing um, relationships. They are not grounded. They are not rooted. They are not committed in their relationships. They can change for any reason that favors them. It can be for sex. It can be for fling. It can be for marriage. It can be for money. Anything. They can just switch without thinking of who they are hurting. So for now, Imaros are just friends. Um, for dating, their energies are just there. We don't, they are not doing, it's not like they are, they are all so in love at the moment and their energies are just there. They are friends, they vibe, they are good, but they are just there. And when their energies changes and, you know, to something more serious and whatever, I will let you guys know. So, for now, I am your host, Mora Lizzie. This is what I have for you guys. Please stay blessed and enjoy the rest of the day.